Um, I'm making, I'm going to show you guys how to make a box or link snare. Um, what you're going to need is, uh, well, I'm working in my house, minus 40 out there, I don't want to do it outside. So, um, this is just a big round steel puck that I'm going to smash my furrows on, and I got my hammer to smash them. I got my cable cutters for, um, that you can buy at your trapping store, supply store. I got my kit here full of my locks and stuff. So we're gonna show you guys how to make this lock, this snare. Um, I got uh, 116 uh, aircraft cable here. It's about uh, two feet long. So what you're gonna start off with is taking your 116 ferro, putting it in one end, and taking your lock. I'm using a cam lock 116. So you're gonna put it in. There's a little plate, and you're gonna take your other end and curve it back into your ferrule here, and tighten up your loop about uh, pretty small. Take your loose end and pass it through the top of your lock, like so. So you have a pretty good loop, and you wanna make sure I didn't crush the ferrule yet. So make sure your lock's on the right end so when it comes down it's going to not go up, it's going to lock. So I'm going to put this snare at uh, 8 inches for Fox. So I'm just going to measure about, uh, I'm going to go about there. I'm going to take another 116 furrow here and put it in the end like so. Bend this back in, like so, and my cable's too long, so I'm going to push my cable through, like so, and I'm going to pull it in, I'm just going to cut this loose end out here. And um, got about eight inches here, so we're gonna go ahead and crush our ferrules here on our block. And you wanna make sure you don't miss and can kink your wire or break any wires. It won't be any good. So I'm gonna pack it in. Now I get pretty good, like so, and it's really crushed down flat. Ooh, do this to the other lock here. To the other one in here. Make sure it maybe uh, once. So well, I don't know. It depends on how you want it to. But I leave a little tad sticking out of my snare. I'm gonna hit that one in. And uh, it's your eight-inch snare. So this is intended for fox or lynx, and uh, if you watch our other videos on uh, how to make the, uh, to make the, the wire to hold up your snare, and you'll see uh, how that's done to hold up your snare. So this is a typical fox and lynx snare, so thanks for watching.